Hello well, folks, this is Jamil Surfer for Gunstruck Reviews. We're here at Caltown USA and we're going to do some ballistic testing with the Springfield Armory Hellcat. Brand new gun that just came out a couple of weeks ago and is causing a lot of excitement with the shooters on a compact gun that holds either 11 or 13 rounds and see how powerful it is with different kinds of defensive ammunition, which is his primary purpose, is going to be a self-defense pistol. So we're going to shoot six kinds of ammunition here, and we're going to try and see how did they perform compared to, you know, uh, other kinds of ammunition, just one versus the other. We're going to start with a CCI Gold Dot first in ballistic gel, and let's do it. Well, we tested the first round, this is going to be a ballistic gel test on the Gold Dot, and we found that it actually went in and backed out. It's kind of a phenomenon I see all the time with some of these uh, high performance rounds. It goes forward and then goes backwards a little bit, so it's, it's hard to determine, but the penetration was almost into the other gel and came back, which is pretty amazing. So it penetrated. I would say stayed under, under 16 inches, but it went and opened up wonderfully. So let's go ahead and shoot the Hydroshock, which is an older round by Federal, but it's still very effective. So let's load around and try the Hydroshock. The Hydroshock penetrated and is in the border of the two gels. I don't know if it went forward and came back to the first gel. I mean, it's just basically went to the second gel enough to penetrate over 16 inches. For being a round that was designed over 25 years ago, this round is very effective and expanded beautifully. So let's go with the next one, which is going to be a more modern round, is the standard HST. So let's go ahead and load one round here of standard HST. And let's try it. The HST penetrated just ba basically just right under the first gel. The expansion, of course, on the HST line of ammunition is perfect. And from shooting it from a short barrel like this one, it is amazing how powerful the HST round is in penetration and performance. Now let's try its heavier 150 grain sister, the HST Micro, which is specifically designed for a micro pistol like this one. The Micro round went far in front of the original round, uh, we, the for first HST we did. It's amazing that a small little 150 grain round, just another, uh, basically 26 grams more, a little more powerful, goes so much farther and expands just the same, because if you see them from the top, they look just the same. The only difference is the weight of the bullet and a little, little taller, but the both rounds perform great. So let's go ahead and try the Federal Train and Protect Ammunition, which is basically your basic hollow point, but it's also meant for training when you want to train with the round you're going to be using. This is a 115 grain bullet. It's a lighter bullet. Let's go ahead and try it. The Train and Protect bullet went in, but it didn't go and go as far as the other more defensive rounds. I need to pull it out and test it, but it opened up really well. But of course, what you expect from any training round, 115 grain, hold it lighter, shorter barrel, it didn't go and didn't penetrate as much. But it's, as a comparison, it's a great comparison. Now, lastly, we're gonna shoot a full metal jacket, 115, just the standard um, American Eagle ammo. Let's go ahead and try it, just for curiosity's sake, okay? The 115 grain, of course, is a round nose bullet. 
115 grain, but it just went farther than anything else because it didn't open up, it didn't expand. So basically retain all this weight and retain its shape and just kept going. It didn't go all the way through two gels, but almost, it was almost at the end of the second gel. So in conclusion, which one is best? Why don't you make up your own mind? Try the round that you like, test a couple of them. I just test, tested six different rounds here today. Check it out, um, look at the conclusions, look at the pictures that we're gonna add of the expanded bullets and see which one you like best and which one is more accurate for you. I think for the Hellcat, the, all the uh, premium rounds, Gold Dot, HSD, Hydroshock, all perform great. So yeah, it's your decision. Try them all and see which one you like best. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews. Please visit our website at www.gunstockreviews.com for more exclusive content. Please visit our patron page at www.patreon.com slash gunstockreviews. Your contributions would be greatly appreciated and help us grow our selections and frequency of videos.